Hey Charlie, hey, welcome back to my channel, Presence of a Goddess. Thank you guys for joining me today. Today is just going to be a quick message for the tribe. So if it resonates, awesome. Appreciate if you subscribe, like, share those you think it resonate too. Any other information you need to know is down below. I'm seeing you number love, peace, and blessings whenever you see this message. Okay, guys, so let's get into a year. Look, I got ancestors here. Okay, period. But I was going to say, somebody could be an Aquarius. Are you guys somebody that's a friend or on your social media that love to hate you? Okay, one minute they want to follow you. Next minute they want to unfollow you. I don't know why you care. I don't think you care, but like you're you're like their um, best friend in their head. Um, I feel like you trigger their parts that they know they need to change or you have them self-reflecting or this is what they're coming to terms with like i really f we um try because you, yeah they coming out of some anger with you somebody's angry about the things you post but it could be something that they're realizing it's within them okay so somebody's mature you're helping people mature it could be more than one person you're a trendsetter as well i feel like you set trends and people like like it okay it's something like that here some people be like mm, like you know what i'm saying maybe throwing shade or whatever but i feel like you are an inspiration okay some of you guys are like in the fashion business or you just know how to put that shit on okay it's something like that yeah, yeah. Somebody could want to stop your glitter, okay? Or you just glittering, baby, okay? Everything you touch is glitter. It's gold, period. All right. <laughs> Everything you touch is gold. What else do I have? Um, let's get into it then. <laughs> Your ancestors are here. Maybe this is where you getting your inspiration from is your ancestors. You know what I'm saying? So, you bringing something back. I'm here. I'm bringing sexy back. The mother don't know how to act. I'm also getting like there's a lover. Like, they don't know how they feel. You make them feel some way. And they don't know how to express it. Okay? Yeah, you have you have full of good ideas here. Maybe this weekend you want to have good full of good ideas or on a weekend whenever you receive this message it's time to write your good ideas down here this weekend is good to get creative or you're getting creative it's good to write them down get a journal yeah you're being guided to follow your heart yo okay so whatever this creative idea you have or these creative ideas write them down and follow your heart and bring them into reality because they're about to be very successful it could happen on a weekend, okay? Some of you guys are like um, musicians, poetry could be significant, um, or you're, like I say, fashion design, fashion designers, um, or you're trying to get something about to take off. It's some idea. It's going to be sent from your ancestors to be, because this is what you're meant to do, and it's going to be very successful. I'm telling you. Some of you guys could be expanding or rebranding your business, and you have all these ideas to do it. And you're like, maybe I shouldn't do it. Maybe you've been procrastinating. Like, maybe I shouldn't do it. Maybe I should just play it safe. No, Spirit saying it's time to expand. Or for you, some of you guys, you already had an idea. You already written it down. It's about to come into reality. And Spirit's about to, like, Spirit been telling you for, like, months. Yeah. And you could be like, I already wrote this down, Spirit. Why you keep on giving me this idea? I already know. Like, you keep on, because you're manifesting it. It's like, you're manifesting it. And it's about to come into fruition. Whatever this idea, whatever this creativity is, it's about to be successful. This could even just be you, like, oh, I want this many followers. I want this many subscribers. I want this many views. I want to make this much amount of money per day. It's something like that. And Spirit about to make it happen for you. You've been manifesting this for months. And you could have been kind of like why is it not happening and spirit's like be patient be patient just keep on and you can't stop you can't get something out of your mind it's because it's about to come into fruition and it's meant to happen for you okay i'm also getting somebody cannot get you out of their mind i'm getting like this is a lover but this is people on social media it's like they always got to check up on you they got to see what you updated because you're an inspiration you're meant to inspire people you're meant to be in people lives i'm hearing for some of you guys you're meant to change lives you're changing lives okay some of you guys y'all take pictures of fashion you making like you making people day because you i don't know fashion could definitely be motivating people i'm really getting that for some of you guys or just your photos in general like you could have like aesthetic photos you could be out in nature you make other people want to go out in nature like you're making something come back like you're bringing sexy back like you're making things look sexy okay <laughs> like that's what i'm getting here people things that people don't want to do because you know we get wrapped up in our technology it's to the point where we forget nature we forget life to live and it's like 
you're you, some of you guys are like vloggers or some of you guys are like influencers and you know people they put a bad name on influencers but there are influencers out there who um living their best life is an inspiration to others and i feel like this is you you're you're meant to live your best life because you're an inspiration to others or you're meant to show people like listen this is what i love to do um I'm not conforming. You're, you're meant to make other people deprogram their mind or stop being a robotic and stop being like um, controlled by the masses. I'm really getting that here. In whatever way you do, all right, you can laugh about this. Life is about to be full of laughter. And I feel like, um, yeah, your laughter is contagious as well. Like you could be laughing and like you make other people laugh. It's like you're very lighthearted. It's like when people get around you, they feel safe, they feel comfortable. And they're like, oh my goodness, like I really like them. It's like because your energy, you're safe. Cause you're safe within your skin. You're healed. You're not one of those people who is like crazy. Okay. I don't know how to explain it. You know how some people you hang with them and like their energy is just so toxic. It's like, you're not like that. People want to hang out with you. So, I mean, some of you guys, you have like a lover or somebody and they like, um, they like, you want to stay tonight? <laughs> like, you have somebody, there's a lover here who is confused on why they are in love with you or they don't know how to admit that they're in love with you. They're like, I think I'm falling in love. Like, you know what I'm saying? Somebody's like, I want her to stay in my home forever. Like, or you about to come and meet somebody like that. Like, you could, uh, you could have like a lover or you about to be with a lover and y'all going to be inseparable because they just, they want to be around you and you want to be around them. I really feel like this person is not draining energy. Like when you're around them, you don't feel drained. This person reciprocates the same energy. I feel like both of you guys could be introverts here. Okay. But when it comes to y'all, y'all like in your own little world. That's for some of you guys. You're beautiful. You're handsome. You're attractive. I feel like your attractiveness is like making people want to be attractive. I don't know. Or make them feel attractive. You could take very nice photos or you're about to take a lot of nice photos. Some of you guys could be photographers. Okay. It's something like that. Somebody could be jealous. Okay. Or you're, like I told y'all, you, you see this, do not be jealous. I feel like um somebody's getting a memo from their spirit game. Like, don't be jealous. This person is a good hearted person. Their intentions are not negative because I really feel like somebody was looking at your social media or this could even be somebody like a friend or something. Um, I feel like this is a new person that you, you have been like acquainted with. And they're like, oh, okay, I thought this person, because, like, it was their own projections. And they're realizing, like, oh, Trav is really cool, and I shouldn't be jealous. I shouldn't be angry at them. They're good-hearted. It's something like that. Or you, People are waking up to the fact that you are a good-hearted person. For some of you guys, you had, like, some type of magic on you where somebody wanted to portray, like, you were a bad person or wanted you to look bad here. Um, but it's not working anymore. It's, it's coming off of you. Yes, it could be somebody's sister. Somebody's sister could be jealous. Okay, or somebody you looked at as a sister. You could have seen this person in your dream. This could be your confirmation. Okay, you're a unicorn and you cannot be stopped. You come with a warning caution. Okay, I don't know why I say a warning caution. A warning um, caution. Yeah, something about that here. Because you mind your business. And you just, you just elevate. Somebody's an Aquarius. You just be like, you fart. Nothing but abundance. You know that song? <laughs> Y'all know that song about Spice? It's like... You think you're the shit, but you're not even a fart. <laughs> Somebody's not even a fart. <laughs> I don't know who this person is that's jealous of you. I really don't think you even know or even care. Um, but I feel like they are like they're obsessed with you, and you're not obsessed with them. But they could be coming to the realization like you're not. You don't even know who they are, or you're not even checking for them, or. Something is really one-sided, okay? Somebody has a one-sided obsession with you. Anyway, I feel like you more so inspire other people um, than people hating on you. Like, the, the love outweighs the hate that people has for you. Yeah, because you somebody's wifey and hubby type. Somebody wants to put a ring on it. Somebody is like going to realize how much they love you and they're going to like want to up the level of love because they bring you peace you're you're getting away from people who don't bring you peace i'm really getting that and this is bringing you abundance so 
Some of you guys, you had to find your peace for you to receive this spiritual wealth or abundance or these creative ideas because spirit couldn't give you something because you didn't have a peace of mind or you didn't have trust and you just didn't, you weren't healed at that time um, enough to get this creative ideas or get this abundance. But now that you are in the vibration of manifesting um, this success that you are manifesting, it's coming in now. Okay, somebody about to get invited to the cookout, okay? Your man or your woman is about to invite you out to the cookout. They want you to stay. I told you, somebody wants you to stay. Like, leave your toothbrush here. Leave your clothes here. Stay with me forever. <laughs> Some of you guys are about to get a stroke of luck here. Okay, this creative idea is going to bring you a lot of luck and a lot of abundance because you have watered yourself. And you watering yourself, you actually helping other people water and heal themselves. You are an inspiration no matter what you are doing. You could be a reader, fashion designer, musician, whatever this is. You're bringing healing to the world. So keep that in mind when you are out here um, showing yourself, not saying you have to live for nobody, but just don't, just be a role model, okay? Be a role model. Remind yourself, is this in alignment with me or am I just doing this to be like everybody else? Because sometimes we can get caught up with being like everybody else. We forget on how to be ourselves. That's for some of us. So don't, so don't do that. Be true to yourself. And I feel like that's something you had to learn, so don't get out of that, okay? Um... Yeah, let me get some letters out. All right, I got Eddie, Soya. I don't know, soybeans could be significant. Somebody could be buying some new shoes. And Sue could be significant. Suzanne, Rosa, Ro Ronita. FRS for uh, first menorah last. Francis, Francesca, Francesca, <laughs> Regine. Story. M I O first minute or last. Mio water could be significant. The letter S first minute or last. Z G O first minute or last. Goya could be significant. F D first minute or last. Frederick. Ferdinand. Fernanda. Fernando. The um, Dominican Republic. Francis. I already said that. Brains could be significant. Um, yeah, that's all I have. Thank you guys.